caring? Yeah. He's handsome. He's kind and nice. Helpful. He's nice and silly. One word that best describes my dad is that he is hardworking. Okay, the word that best describes my dad is generous. He is always giving, whether it's time or money or resources or know-how. Pretty much if he has it, I think he would probably give it to you. <laughs> One word that describes my dad would be leader. Um, no matter what he's involved in, um, he's in the forefront. Um, he's a leader in church. He is a leader in work and his job and at home with our family. One word that describes you best um, would be devoted. You're devoted to your faith, your family, and your work and I've always admired that about you. Um, I would say dependable. A word to best describe my dad is protector. One word that best describes my father is devoted to his family, uh, to his wife, to God, and dad is very devoted. Hero. It's a little cheesy, but um, dad was my role model and everything to me when I was a kid and that uh, that didn't change throughout my life you know he served uh, his country he uh, was the best family man you could ask for served his church his community uh, so to me those quality qualities uh, solidify what I thought about him and to me that's everything a man and a father should be couldn't ask for anything more I would say hard working. One word that would best describe my dad would be loving. Um, I've always felt secure in his uh, love for me and his care for myself and my brothers. Um, wrestle with dad. Wrestle with dad. Play card games. Um, play books. Farming. Uh, farm with me. My favorite thing to do with my dad is swim and plant vegetables in the garden. My favorite thing to do with my dad is to go foraging. Uh, and that's kind of a, a term that I've coined for when I make him get out in the wintertime, most of the time on a rainy day. Um, and we go and look for anything that's still green in the wintertime. And I use it around my house as Christmas decorations. And um, half the time, I don't even use half the stuff that we bring back. But um, it is a fun time that I get my dad all to myself. And so I really have grown to cherish those days. I can't just pinpoint something specific. Um, but anything outdoors, um, such as boating, golfing, hunting, or just sitting on the porch together. Um, we love doing that. One of my favorite things to do with you is probably uh, anything sports related, whether it's on a field, a court, uh, or a course. Um, we are pretty competitive with each other, so I love being able to um, be involved in sports with you and play together and against each other as well. Something that I've always enjoyed, we used to watch old action and horror movies together. Uh, we also used to go hunt arrowheads at different farms around town. Um, that was always something we both really enjoyed. One of the things I love doing most with my dad is family history, researching all kinds of cool things about our ancestors. My favorite thing to do with him is anything that makes him laugh. Whether he's hooked a big bass and he's trying to get it back to the bank, <laughs> uh, laughing uncontrollably, or if, if I'm telling him a joke he knows he shouldn't laugh at, if it gets a good laugh out of him, that's, that's what I love. My favorite thing to do with my dad is fish. Um, it's one of my favorite ho hobbies, and he was the one that taught me how to do it. Um, it's something that I hope to do with this little guy uh, in a couple years, and uh, just absolutely love it. There's nothing better on a prettier day, and don't even have to talk a lot. Just uh, sit there, enjoy a pretty day, and, and hopefully reel in some fish, and uh, just enjoy the time being outside. When I am at home, our favorite thing to do is just to hang out. Um, as a child, I remember going to the garage and hanging out with you there and working on the farm equipment and everything. The, one of my favorite things to do with my dad is just spending quality time with him, um, getting to just enjoy being with him, talking, um, also enjoy traveling the last couple of years um, for family trips uh, with him.
tickle you? <laughs> he he eats our neck meat, and when he does it to me, it makes it so funny. Coach me and my friends. I wrestle. I think that makes me smile or happy is when my dad takes me on vacations. One thing that my dad does that makes me smile is playing with my babies. <laughs> I love when he is teaching Casey and how to use the excavator or just holding Millie and making her giggle. I love, I love when he's playing with my babies. He's gonna be shocked about this, but uh, when we go for a ride on the farm together, um, I always grew up doing that with him and it makes me just as happy now <laughs> as it did then. One thing that you do that makes me smile and happy is just when you sing. Um, whether it's at church, at a wedding, or in any occasion, even in the car, um, I just love uh, hearing your voice and, and watching you use the gift that you've been given. He's always quick to, to laugh. Uh, uh, he's quick with a joke or, or laughing at somebody else's jokes. He doesn't think, take things too seriously. One of the things that makes me the most happy to see my dad doing would be playing with his grandbabies. He is all in. One thing he does that makes me happy is playing with my son. It brings them both the most genuine, authentic joy, and it's a pleasure to watch. Um, it's indescribable. One thing Dad does that always made me smile and happy is uh, the way I watched him treat my, my mother. And it gave me uh, guidelines on how to treat a woman, how to treat uh, your wife, and uh, if a man ever loved a woman, it was it was my father and uh, my mom, and that has helped me uh, throughout my life uh, find the woman that I married, and uh, gave me a, a guidebook of how to be a uh, a husband and a father, and uh, how to treat the woman you love. Just cutting up with you and watching your interaction with your grandchildren and how much you love them and love being around them. Uh, one thing that my dad does that makes me smile um, is he enjoys singing. And when we were kids, he would just be going about his day to day and just singing <laughs> as long as he did. Um, it just always made for a really joyful, um, fun time. Um, he helps other people and he's kind and nice. And he, when Michelle needs help, he helps Michelle. I'm kind. Well, baseball. One thing that makes me proud that he's my dad is that he takes care of our family. Something that makes me proud of my dad is how hard of a worker he is. He's a very hard worker and um, he's almost always, always working on something, whether it's big or small, he's always got a project going and um, I admire his work ethic. Uh, and that would be when he prays, uh, whether at church or at home, knowing he's a man of God um, makes me proud. You're probably the hardest working person I know um, and you've always helped provide for us as a family um, and I just uh, really love you and appreciate you for that. He is always there when you need him. I know that if anyone asked him for help, he would give it without question. He's always reliable and dependable. Um, the thing that makes me the most proud about my dad would have to be his loyalty to God, country, and family above all else. Something he does that makes me proud that he's my, my dad, um, it's his principles. He has his priorities on straight. Uh, he prioritizes his time with his, with his family, uh, his relationship with God, and his marriage. What makes me proud is just how much you love God and your family. Um, one thing that my dad does that makes me proud that he's my dad is just his heart and love for the Lord and for serving others. He's always definitely been an example of a servant leader and I've always appreciated that. And um, for him, it's always taught me a lot as well. He's teaching you how to play guitar. What else has dad taught you how to do? Um, mow. To mow, he taught you how to mow? 
um, he tells other people about God, God, and tells people about God. And he loves God so much and Jesus so much. To be a good person. My brother taught me something. Can I tell you that? Swing the bat. The most important thing that my dad taught me is to be kind to others. The most important thing that my dad has taught me is to prioritize fellowship with other believers and prioritize being at church. Um, he's done a really good job of exemplifying that for me and my family, and I really appreciate that. It's a good lesson to learn. Trust the Lord no matter what you do. Um, and also, anything that you do, such as sports, work, um, etc., just give your all. And he's going to kill me for this one. Uh, always look good no matter where you go. Um, and we'll deny that, but it's so true. Probably to love the Lord, um, work hard, and just be true to myself. Uh, I would say the most important thing my dad has taught me is how to be reliable. Um, to be there for your fam uh, family and friends, um, to live life with a light heart, and to be kind. That's a hard one, but I would have to say commitment. Everything else seems to come and go, but commitment, if you've got it, you're good. An important thing he has taught me is be thankful. Every good gift, every blessing we have comes from above, um, and Dad constantly reinforces that and encourages us to to be thankful for those and to recognize where they come from. The most important thing that dad ever taught me was uh, the importance of faith and family and in that order. Uh, if your faith is right, uh, if you have your ducks lined up in a row and your priorities correct um, and your eyes on uh, the Lord, then everything else will fall into place. And uh, second, that uh, on this planet that uh, blood is thicker than water. Uh, your family ties and your relationships with those who share your blood. Uh, when the whole world falls apart, you still have them. And uh, he's proved that. He's always been there for me uh, throughout the thick and thin. And uh, I plan on um, being the same way with, with my little family. Is how to uh, live in a godly home and be a a good parent and teaching the Word of God to my children. Uh, the most important thing that my dad has taught me is to uh, care for others and to love others. Happy Father's Day, Daddy. Happy Father's Day, Daddy. Happy Father's Day, Dad. I love you. Happy Father's Day. Happy Father's Day! Um, Happy Father's Day, Dad. I love you. Happy Father's Day, Dad. Love you. So, Dad, I hope you have a great Father's Day. Thank you for everything, and I love you. Uh, Happy Father's Day, Dad. I love you. Happy Father's Day, Dad. I love you. Happy Father's Day, Pop. You're the best. Happy Father's Day, Dad. Uh, thanks for giving me uh, so many lessons growing up and teaching me how to be a father to this little guy. I hope you have a great day. Happy Father's Day. I love you. Happy Father's Day from the South, Dad. I hope you're having a good day. And I hope Mom fixes you a big, delicious lunch. And Happy Father's Day, Dad. I love you.